Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can clear your search history in SharePoint Online. Let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So here I am at the SharePoint start page and I decide to search for something, right? And of course it gives me all these different suggestions, you know, the sites I was part of and all that stuff. And uh, it also shows me the recent searches as well I have done, all right? And it's the same uh, option uh, essentially that you see in Google or Facebook, right? You know, how they uh, give you suggestions on whatever it is that you're searching. Same idea here. This is some of the recent searches I have. Now, I want to clear that, all right? I want to clear this um, results. You know, I don't want them to appear in here anymore. I want to uh, essentially, I don't want any more suggestions uh, based on my uh, history of using SharePoint, all right? Uh, so let me show you how to do that. Uh, each one of you, you can do it yourself, all right? This is something you do personally on your account. So uh, I'm logged in as Mary here, and I'm going to uh, go to uh, my account. And then once I am in my account, uh, I need to click on settings and privacy, and then the privacy tab, all right? And where you want to click is this Microsoft search history. Now, there are a few options here. So first of all, you can download your history, all right? And, you know, essentially this is where the search boxes appear, right? You know how you have, uh, you can search in Outlook. You know, you can download that history or I can just download uh, the SharePoint and uh, search from SharePoint start page as well as that Microsoft 365 office.com, you know, splash page. All right. And then it will essentially save it locally to your computer. But in our case, uh, I also want to clear the search history. So uh, I will just click this clear search, uh, clear history, I'm sorry, button. And again, I can clear both Outlook and SharePoint uh, search history. Let's just do this one. All right, and that's it. It tells me it has been cleared. Uh, let's confirm that's the case. I'm going to refresh the screen. Hopefully it's not going to take a lot of time. And yeah, unfortunately, the, the search results still appear. I think it, if I'm not mistaken, it does take uh, some time for it to take effect, but uh, soon, uh, essentially, your search results will be cleared and essentially you're not going to have uh, to see any suggestions appear in, in this um, in the search box. So here we go after a few minutes and a few refreshes. Uh, of my page, I, it actually took effect, uh, and uh, I'm on the same SharePoint start page. And when I click uh, on this uh, search box, as you can see, all those personal recommendations are gone now. It just shows me kind of the standard, you know, stuff. Uh, this will kind of always be there. But uh, remember those uh, keyword searches that you got to see uh, a little bit earlier, they're gone now. And the reason for that is uh, because I cleared my search history. All right, now very important, uh, it only clears those uh, suggestions, if you will, all right? Uh, it doesn't erase, um, you know, uh, your activities, I guess, um, from the uh, audit perspective. So uh, if you are searching for something, if you download something, if you uh, move the document somewhere, uh, you know, stuff like that, uh, those activities are still, uh, are still accessible to the SharePoint administrators or right from within the uh, audit log and the compliance center. So just wanted to make that clear. But at least now you're not going to receive suggestions. Maybe you just went to one of the SharePoint sites and you really you know, don't, uh, you know, want any suggestions or on, on some searches that you did, um, you know, based on your activities, recent searches, uh, you can, uh, you know, obviously uh, easily utilize this trick, uh, this uh, trick to, um, um, you know, search for, to, to clear the search uh, history uh, for your personal profile, all right? So that's all I wanted to uh, show you in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.